team have got this right, uh, it's really nothing short of sensational because uh, we have a new lineage of humans in Asia and one that had a separate evolutionary history and which we can relate to a particular group of people alive today. So the picture we did have was that about 500,000 years ago there was a species Homo heidelbergensis and we can see the big brow ridges at the front, the long low skull, quite primitive looking. Heidelbergensis went then in Europe on to give rise to the Neanderthals. In Africa, it gave rise to us, Homo sapiens. But we didn't know how people in places like China related to these other humans. But with this new find, we can build up a picture now that Heidelbergensis not only gave rise to Neanderthals of modern humans, but over in the Far East, it gave rise to an entirely separate lineage of humans, which evolved there for hundreds of thousands of years. And then at the end of its time, contributed some of its DNA to people living in Southeast Asia today. So we have a, a completely new picture here based on the DNA evidence that allows us to look at Asian evolution in a completely new way.